scares you this year that thing that you want to do so badly but you're nervous and you're second guessing it and you're scared and you just like don't want to do it because you're horrified do it this year because I know it's corny to say like 2018 will be my year but it can be and it will be and there's a lot of things that scare me and I'm gonna try to step outside of my comfort zone and do them from athlete search and kind of just um failing because like, in my mind I failed you set your bar somewhere and you didn't reach it I missed the mark and I fell short in some way and I'm gonna make sure that it doesn't happen again hello guys and welcome to the first video of my prep series I'm sharing everything with you guys so I'm sharing my scary big goals ideally I would really love to take an overall um whether that be at a regional show or a national show I want an overall win. That would be really, really, really freaking awesome and exciting and just the craziest thing ever to be like the best at a show. I think a lot of people know by now I really want to go pro this year. Hopefully you guys can watch me achieve those. And I'm, I don't want to say in a dark place because like it's not that deep, but I just am really in a place of insecurity and like lack of confidence and just like a lot of self-doubt recently. In a way I'm not that excited to make content or do things like that because I just feel like I'm not good enough or as good as other people are and I'm trying really hard to not let it get to me because it's literally just self-destructive. Find your way back home Good morning guys, it is Wednesday and I am flying out to St. Louis today. I don't really know what today entails, but I'm super excited and I'm gonna try to take you guys along as much as possible with me. To be my travel vlog to Ohio for the Arnold. Unfortunately, he won't be going. because I hate when people say like I'm doing something but I can't tell you what but um we're currently in Hollywood and we are meeting with someone today but I don't I want to get their permission before like saying anything about it all right so this is coach Paige training a Rob Alex Rodriguez hang on hang on hang on hang on this is Paige talking macronutrients and diet with a Rob <laughs> 
So I kind of wanted to give you guys a little update, kind of just a life and prep update. So since I told you guys last, uh, my macros have been dropped again. I feel like I'm 11 weeks out now, so I'm still doing really well for being 11 weeks out, so I'm not really worried at all. I'm just gonna sit and work on my email list going out on Saturday. I have a new workout going out. Um, if you guys didn't know, every Saturday I send out a free workout through my email list, so it's always in my description box to subscribe. But I'll post a picture right here of me yesterday, and I, I mean, I feel good and I feel lean, um, but we just want to make sure that we're making progress still. Here we are today. My weight is really being an asshole to me. So I still feel good. Um, I still feel like I look okay and everything. But again, like, I mean, we're eight weeks and five days out now. So time to really just make sure that we are where we need to be. It's Easter. Um, my family is actually, obviously, as you know, visiting. So I'm actually going to be able to spend, well, would be spending Easter with them and yeah these are the days where it's like why am I prepping <laughs> and I hate that like I hate when days like this come because it makes you kind of like question why you even do it like what's the point um but it's hard to explain what I love about prep I just feel like it changes me for the better as a person and it the way that I'm tested just it builds character any way that I could grow as a human prep does that for me so that's why I love prep. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear mom. <laughs> Basically, this is kind of a test shoulder workout to see how it goes because I am kind of working on something that I mentioned on my Instagram, something shoulder related. So I'm doing this workout to kind of see how it goes. Hey girl, let's go. Come on, kid. You need to learn to be as honest as possible with yourself. Call yourself out on your bullshit. Realize when you aren't following through with your word. And I'm not talking about like your word to other people. I'm talking about your word to yourself. That's a shitty feeling. Like you don't want to let people down like that. And for me, disappointing myself now is just as heartbreaking and upsetting as disappointing someone else. Find your way back home. So yesterday was Tuesday. I weighed 113.0, which was a new low weigh-in. And then today, uh, Wednesday, I weighed 112.6. And I haven't hit the 112s um, during this prep at all. So crazy, it's getting so close. I cannot believe I'm only five and a half weeks out. It is Friday, so I checked in with my coach today. I had a new low weigh-in of 112.2. So I'm feeling like really good. I'm feeling pretty small, actually. Like, I'm really starting to feel like leaned out and just like super tiny. I registered for my show, so it's now official. I had to get my MPC card and register for the show. So So I had a new low win, 111.0. Um, we're almost in the 110s, that's so crazy. I think macros and cardio have stayed the same for the past three weeks, which is really, really good. And I'm four weeks out, so that's absolutely insane. All right, so here is the breakfast. Um, every single day. Probably gonna be at the gym for like two or three hours since um, we have to take all the photos for my guide, which is why I put on some fake lashes. I 
It is Friday. I actually have work today. I never work Fridays. So I am 109.8 this morning. Like what on earth? I'm literally under 110 now. Three weeks out tomorrow. So I'm just saying I'm three weeks out. That's insane. So the guide is live. So basically what the guide is, is it's an eight week shoulder guide. Just finished cardio though. So I'm actually gonna pose now. I'm on a last rush. I'm broken. I was 107.6. I love this part of prep where it's almost like every single day you see changes. I'm two weeks out um, tomorrow, so that's so insane. week yeah wait I'm not too worried about it it's not my lowest right now but essentially yeah I got my peak week plan I'm hyped the last long session of cardio is over and I finally dropped down to 106.2 this morning I am so tired I'm about to open this. I'm actually not gonna show you guys. It's so crazy. I cannot believe we are show day Eve Eve. Go for it. Oh, oh my god. Miserable all morning. Instant smiles. Thank God. Number one. My hideous, hideous figure. Yes, you do. <laughs> so yeah, that's the current situation. And I'm just gonna rest up. Honestly, that's all I can do for now. The work is done. We are here. We are tanned up. We're ready to go. I'm like really nervous but really excited and kind of like at peace i just i'm excited for show day i just am excited to see the outcome um i feel like i have an envision in my head of how it's gonna go and how i hope it goes and it's always just exciting to see kind of how everything plays out the gang is here while wow, we're all in the mirror shot right now hi you see that don't freak me out don't freak me out that's good in the best way i love it <laughs> That's right. Dead center, let's go! Let's go! That's where you belong! Thank you, ladies. All you 110! Let's go! Paige just uh, finished dead center, meaning she's uh, in the number one spot. And uh, she killed it. We wanted that sword. We're in a position to go get a sword now. Keeping it clean between shows because we're coming for that overall. Oh. Let's go! That's right, Pete! That's right, Paige! Come on. Oh my god. Limited bikini overall champion this evening is number 110. Let's go! Woo! 
<laughs> That's right! That's my queen! Oh my god! As you guys saw, I took the fucking overall. That was the goal coming into this, and I just can't believe it happened. I kind of have no words, so I'm gonna give you guys an update tomorrow. I'm finally sitting down to film this and I still don't even feel like ready like I don't know how to put it into words I didn't express to you guys how badly I wanted to win the overall I think I still had part of me that wasn't sure that I would actually be able to do it and for me um, sometimes that holds me back from saying it out loud or like telling people that's what I want because I almost get nervous if it doesn't happen I'll be embarrassed Anthony and I have been talking about it since day one of this prep I I'm gonna say it now, um, I hope to go pro this year. That's my goal for this competition season. I wanna go pro this year. And again, that even scares me to say out loud because like I said before, if it doesn't happen, I'll feel embarrassed. You guys gave me strength when I needed it um, without you even knowing just you guys being there and I just wanted to make you guys proud. I just want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for everything and hopefully this is just the beginning. The same donuts I bought for post show, they held a giveaway and I entered it. Why did I enter it? I'm not quite sure because I freaking won and I can't have any of these. So you make amends with the demons you've been through. I can't regret. It is travel day, so I'm flying to St. Louis today. Show you kind of everything about my travel experience and how I travel on prep because your girl is almost two weeks out. You alone until you find your way back home. beginning of peak week which is why we're drilling cardio today just trying to really bring that conditioning home so I'm actually I'm so excited like I don't mind I feel like this is like what I live for right now I'm gonna put a few progress pictures here I guess um, I didn't take a video this morning I just kind of took pictures with my phone and sent them to my coach at 104.4 this morning which is a new low weigh in by 0.2 pounds I probably feel the tightest I felt all week I've been going back and forth in my head kind of like feeling good not feeling good um, but today I feel pretty good I've been putting a lot of pressure on myself for this show and you know what it is what it is and I'm going in there with a really big goal and I'll be really upset if I don't achieve that goal but really it just is what it is get good check-in photos right now because it's literally dark and gloomy it's raining it is 6 45 a.m i've been up since four <laughs> your shoulders are ridiculous dude Makeup by Stacy. She killed it. Hey. Yeah, P. Go, P. There you go. Get it, girl. Okay, so I got first call outs. Um, it is looking like the third or fourth spot, so I did not get top two, which is okay. Nationals, so kid. Woo That's all right. Story. One place away from being a pro. I'm really at 
peace with my placing. I feel okay um, getting third. Like, they deserved it, and I... It wasn't my time. Um, and I think there's definitely a reason for that happening last night. Being just one away. There, There's a reason I was one away. They didn't want to give it to me that easy, and it's fine. I'm up for, you know, the chase. Um, I'm going to go to USA's next. I am going to do another national show in, I think it's four weeks from today, so... Don't let me drown Don't let me drown It is now Wednesday, July 11th, so I am 16 or 17 days out. My weight is finally, we're finally coming back down. So we're probably gonna have to push a little bit this uh, next couple of weeks, but I'm totally cool with it. Like I said, I'm down for this, you know, journey. Um, I have this goal in mind and I will do what it takes to Don't achieve it. Let me I wanted to share this with you. I was kind of contemplating not ever really saying anything about it because I didn't know how the response would be. So I quit my job. I didn't like quit today. My two weeks notice is in. It has actually been enough to hold me above water, um, cover all of my bills and kind of keep me afloat. And I was hanging on to my restaurant job for honestly one sole purpose. And the reason for that was the amount of people that have said to me, I love that you have a real job still. And you still go to work and stuff like that. And those comments, they like ate at me. And I was like, I can't let people down by quitting my job and you know, doing basically what I've been trying to achieve for years now. Like I felt guilty um, quitting my job and having my own source of income and I didn't want to do it because I didn't want to let people down and people were like proud of me for having a real job. I was literally working from the moment I woke up to the moment I went to sleep. And I'm not saying that's going to change or that now all of a sudden my life's going to be so much easier and I have so much less work, but I can dedicate that time that I spend the restaurant to bettering my content. And I just want to be as honest and just show the not so glamorous and fun parts about prep because I have literally just been existing the past two weeks. I'm just like a human walking the earth with no like soul, no emotions. I'm just going through my daily life doing the bare minimum of what I need to do and that's kind of it. And like I feel so bad for Anthony, I feel bad for my friends, my family, like I just, I don't show attention to my loved ones anymore. I don't have the extra energy to give. It is Friday and I am seven days out. It is the beginning of peak week. Hello, we are home and we are doing an unboxing video. <laughs> Anthony wants to. I haven't felt this moment since college. So you find your way back home Three days out, getting a duck, so... No, I'm curious. So you want it under one and you're at a zero and that's, <laughs> oh, you can't get better than that. You literally know oh, that's real fat. That's crazy. So you're pretty healthy. <laughs> you have 88 pounds. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you. So you guys know about these already. I already told you about these. These are the goods. We need those. And we cannot forget. We will not forget. <laughs> I already wrote it down. Highlighted. Underlined. City cakes, baby. <laughs> and the time has come. We're on the road. One day out. We're doing tester show day makeup, but also I needed it for my photo shoot. Smile. I know we don't have 
lips on, but we're So we're gonna go get this shoot done, um, and after that, yeah, I'm gonna go see Paul, and I just need to go home and chill for the rest of the night. This is what we in the biz call dialed, ladies and gentlemen. Damn, you look crazy, dude. This is insane. Thanks, guys. No pump. Jesus. <laughs> Let's go, P! Go, P! Yeah, P! Keep it tight, P! Let's go! Let's go, 227! Keep that smile, P! There you go! Woo! Let it go! Got it, girl! Switch 227 and 207. That's right! Yeah! Let's go! Let's go, Pete! 227 and 205. Let's go! Yeah, Pete! Let's go! Okay, thank you very much. You're gonna fly. Yeah! Let's go! Pretty much means I pitched IFBB Pro. I can't regret leaving you alone until you find your way back home. We're going to battle tonight, kid. Let's fucking go. Good girl. <laughs> Woo Spread your last a little bit farther. <laughs> Turned pro this weekend, absolutely insane experience overall. Um, I'm sure all of you know that was the goal going into the show, and we did it. That's, uh, that's San Diego, right? Yeah. And what's the date of that show? Um, August 18th. It's my birthday, actually. <laughs> <laughs> that kind of makes it even cooler. I know, Thank right? You. Birthday, off-season starts. Pro yeah. debut, you know, you get to enjoy your birthday actually after, you know. Yeah, so I feel like my mental's totally there. Um, the only thing is, like, I just hope that my physique is, like, good enough, almost. Because I'm hard on myself. Yeah, just a few more chains and I will get away. Just a few more things I gotta get out my way now. I'm never turning, never turning back. I just couldn't shake the exhaustion and I was getting very frustrated because that's what I do I get super frustrated with myself with my situation just like I don't want to be so tired and when I'm tired and I can't shake it like I get pissed off and frustrated I think it's 12 days left um, for my pro debut and it is just like every day I'm like oh my god and you know, I am like mentally fine with pushing. I feel like my body's really fighting me right now, which is very frustrating because I'm like, why now? I missed you guys, but I definitely needed that like mental break of like a five day break. I also got my guide finished, which is really exciting. Um, I wanted to hit this deadline and I was so happy that I was able to do it. So 
by the time you're watching this, it will be dropping today. So it is still purple, but it's more of a magenta. So as you guys can see, the the fabric itself is like a, is a magenta. It's yeah. like purple. It's got more pink tones than I think it's shown on camera, but oh my God. All right. damn, that's so sick. All right, three days out. And we're three days out for my birthday. I keep neglecting that fact. So beyond excited for this. Damn, they look These so are dang. Nuts. Being able to literally go from an amateur level stage to now I'm standing next to these freaking pros who are on the Olympia stage like that's nuts and I'm so proud to just be able to even do that so I'm excited for the experience um, I'm just gonna get my toes wet here it just feels really good to go into a show basically just strictly to have fun and enjoy the experience every single show had something that was weighing on me that I really really wanted and it was like a big goal for me good morning guys we are one day out all right so I just finished check-ins and I am lucky number 13 tomorrow. And it's on the evening. Yeah, literally. <laughs> I love hearing that. That's so cool. Like, you're that, you're that good. So. 9.30 now. Probably get tanned up around 10, 15, 10.30. And then I'm on stage at noon. I really need to grow. My body is over it. I'm excited to just hit off season and grow. The point of this show was to get the experience and learn, and that's what we did. And hey, on Oh my god. <laughs> that's what, PBJ? Baby, I'm fired up. Baby, I'm fired up. The professional league is no joke. I basically got last um, at my show. Like I literally went from first place to last place. So that just shows kind of the big dogs that are in the IFBB, the pro league. Um, so I have a lot of growing and maturing and just um, overall muscle development that I personally feel like I need. Oh, baby, I'm fine. So now like my body is actually really starting to kind of change um, You know weight is coming on and for me like I gain it in my face and my torso like my midsection like pretty quickly today I really noticed like I wasn't feeling very comfortable with myself And I was like change I changed my outfit like a hundred times because I just couldn't like I didn't feel good in anything So it's just like one of those days where I was just not feeling good. We're heading to Vegas right now as you guys saw we hit Denny's there's no other way to start a trip off. I'm almost free. And when I go, I'm never looking back. No sound so bad.
So fragile. We just got approved for the apartment. They're like, moving date tomorrow? <laughs> like, well, I guess. It was built to break off the handle. How'd we get to this place? <laughs> it's freaking 9.53 in the morning. I don't like working out this early. I'm loving it. I'm not. Do some shoulder stuff with Paige Riley. Whoa. <laughs> November 1st so I just want to give you guys a little bit more information on it um, if you weren't aware like I have the shoulder guide and the back guide so I'm now doing the leg guide Let's slow down I want to live right now I'm not worried thinking about tomorrow earlier than her and uh surprise her with some breakfast in bed good morning your oatmeal is really not easy to make <laughs> i'm gonna stick up for uh for all the people in the internet yeah, world that's good, that's good. finalizing the guide because it is drop day so it is available now when you're watching this video um it's live already so it's always linked in the description so check it out if you're interested let's go come on there it is go easy good. come on Three, let's go. I got you. Four, five, six, two more. Come on. One more, you grind it out. Grind it. Grind. Good girl. And my mom is competing this weekend, so I'm going home to uh, see her and be with her. Only time will tell, but I'll be holding you. I'll be holding you. my ass in the gym I'm working hard I'm doing everything I can to better myself in this off season so that's like the most important thing in my eyes and if I can enjoy myself along the way that's the way I want to do it and I didn't like tell you guys this but I got a new camera so this is gonna be like my vlog cam and then I wanted to get like a nice really good camera um, for more of like I don't know like close-up cinematic stuff
Uh, you're getting a computer, right? You are. Here we go. Anthony's B-Day gift. Today is leg day for Paige. And you guys know that when Paige does leg day, we try to get her to throw up. So today is no different. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. On the bright side. Yeah, yeah. Hey. Yeah. One leg out that brand new Ben's way. Hometown asking me my wrist, yeah. Repetition from my chest, that's a bench press. Studio, we chillin', are we making hits? Yes, we Okay. That, Thanks. <laughs> that one's really good. If you have a goal in mind to build muscle, get your calories up, um, whatever it may be, you have to go through this period. I have a bad body image moment probably every day. Like every single day, I'll look in the mirror or see myself at a certain angle and be like, no, like I don't, I don't like that. Um, but you have to try to appreciate different things about your body at different phases. Everyone has struggles, everyone has bad body image days, no one's immune to it, so don't think that you're alone in having bad body image days. Or you wish I was pissed for, saw they getting mad, but what they really getting pissed for? Seeing more behind the frame, future brother feel the shame, thinking ain't nobody feel the way I do, but someone gotta feel the same, yeah. On the bright side, yeah, this music here became my only lifeline. Think I'm going crazy, I'm not in my right mind yeah. Welcome to my life, welcome to my life yeah. On the bright side Yeah, this music here became my only lifeline Think I'm going crazy, I'm not in my right mind no. Welcome to my life, welcome to my life yeah. Welcome to my life, welcome to my life Yeah Welcome to my life, welcome to my life, yeah On the bright side, yeah this music here became my only lifeline Think I'm going crazy, I'm not in my right mind, yeah Welcome to my life, welcome to my life Save some lights from these notes, baby bite in my flow I don't need a Grammy trying to bring the life what I wrote I don't drive, I just coast Alright, here we are Here's me, here's Anthony <laughs> Yeah, I kind of kind of got ahead of myself there, but don't get high, I just flow. I, I be chilling with my homies, breaking bread. It's time we eat. Yeah, 51 in NFL studios with the beats on the hook. I be catchy on the 16s. I'm a freak. I be texting with destiny about time that we meet. She ain't bad it for you. I bet she's bad it for me, for real. Um, what is one thing I love doing, but most people don't? I said body build. So. I said Excel spreadsheets. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's very true. What weird talent do I have? This is the last one. What'd you put? I put snowboarding. Oh, I put putting on screen protectors. <laughs> what is the, the end goal for you career-wise? So, um, I feel like I'm so uncertain of this. I don't, I really don't know. I just want it to serve me and make me so happy and be excited to work every single day and... That's kind of all I can hope for. I just know I want it to be something that fulfills me, serves me, makes me so happy, and that's kind of all I know. On my way to surprise Anthony, so him and I are both in New York right now, but I live three hours, three and a half hours north of him. Because I'm literally like nervous. Like my belly hurts. I don't know why. Uh, so I am uh, pulling down your street actually. You're what? I'm pulling down your street. <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> I decided last night. I love you. Welcome to my life. Welcome to my life. Yeah. Welcome to my life. Welcome to my life. Yeah.